Hi everyone, I'm Claire. And I'm John. And today we are talking about healthy hell. Ooh, I, I can really feel this title. I think mm. I'm not a sort of fitness, healthy oh, living yeah. type person. Mm. So healthy and hell just, just mm. match really well, really logically in my mind. Mm. Um, but uh, uh, <laughs> ignore me, I'm not a good example. I was imagining hell with a vegetable tray. Yeah, yeah. I think to a lot of kids, mm. you know, they can understand mm. what healthy hell is. Oh, it's all the veggies on the tray, and mummy saying it's very tasty. <laughs> and they're like, ah, this is, I'm died and gone to hell. That's why America puts cheese and stuff on it. Oh, I do love cheese. But anyway, let's yeah, not yeah, get distracted. Okay. It's not maybe it's not quite an article about what you're imagining or what I'm instantly imagining. But here's a clue, John. Okay. I'm going to change the question slightly because it, it, it's it's not helpful to ask it in this way. But nope. how, how about this? <laughs> Have you ever uh -huh. met someone who served in the military? Yeah, that probably is mm. a better question. Have you met someone who served? Uh, my brother um, and my grandfather and my father, actually, all Thanks. served at one point in the military. But of course, my brother did it while I was alive, mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, whereas the other two did it way before I was born. Mm -hmm. And I'm guessing this mm -hmm. is in America, so he did it by choice? Yes, he did it by choice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It was his choice. It was your choice, remember. <laughs> And for how long did he do it? Oh, I think it was three and a half years. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He got out a little early for, due to an injury. Oh. And that was about it, yeah. He, they were like, yeah, you're basically done. You're injured enough. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, I'd hate to be the one who has to decide that. Yeah. Are yeah. you injured Bye. enough? Mm -hmm. um, so, <laughs> at any point during his service, uh -huh. or any of your friends or family who've mm -hmm. been, did anyone ever say the military military service is fun? Um, I, I can't say that he said the words fun. I know that there were things that both, well, my grandfather not so much, but my father and brother, they, they had good memories mm -hmm. from the military, some good memories and some bad ones. Oh, okay. My father had a lot of better ones because I don't think he went into any war zone like uh, my grandfather or my brother did. Um, but yeah, they had moments that were good, but over by and large, I wouldn't say that they think the experience was fun. Mm. <laughs> yeah, especially basic. Oh, goodness, mm. basic training. Basic yeah. training, sorry. Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes, mm. I mean, even people, yeah, I've known a couple of guys who are in the British mm. Army, I know a guy now who was in the American army. And the, yeah, again, there's things that they enjoyed or they found useful, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. but the word fun just doesn't seem appropriate. <laughs> <laughs> no, I want to go back. Yeah. Let's do it again, Daddy. Yeah, it was Woo. a great big game. Yeah. Um, so, healthy hell, the military, and fun, mm -hmm. all these ideas mm -hmm. swirling. I bet you're mm -hmm. curious to know more. So. Go ahead, read the article, maybe the full thing or just the summary for the quick overview. And let's come back together in part two and discuss it. See you there. Healthy hell. Most people who have to serve in the military dislike it and just want to get it done as quickly as possible. But even if it's not pleasant, studies have shown that military life has some very good health benefits. People who are overweight slim down, as expected, but underweight people also gain weight in the military. Key indicators such as blood pressure and cholesterol also improve a lot after a year in the Army. The regimented life, with plenty of exercise, regular sleep, and limited access to food, seems to be the reason.